Friday, Dr. Bones came out here and said a few things about me. I was wondering if we could uh, watch those on the monitor, if possible. But ladies and gentlemen, there was supposed to be another hell of a wrestling match here tonight with me, the finest wrestler here. Let's hear it for me. And a man by the name of Tack. Who? Well, let me tell you this. Tack swears up and down how great of a wrestler he is. He comes out here, he does arm drags, he does hip bosses, he does headlock takeovers. None for me or any of the fans because Tack is not here tonight. Therefore, you do not get to see the greatest wrestler around, Dr. Bones, do his craft. You know, Bones, as exciting as that was, exciting as it was seeing you flop around the ring, I do have to apologize for not being here. Yes, it was unprofessional that I was not here, but you know the reason why I wasn't here? Someone very close to me fell ill. And Thursday night, I had to fly back to Fargo to see them. So I'm sorry you don't understand that. But as with that, as with the technical aspect of what I do, you wouldn't understand. Because you're too busy running around here being a fool. For what reason? You've pushed me, and you've pushed me, and you've pushed me. What do you want, Bones? That's what I want to know. What's in your head? Uh, I think Tack is about to get an answer to that question as Dr. Bones, the dapperly attired Dr. Bones, makes his way to the ring. Some interesting footwear. Well, it's gone. You want to know what I want, Tack? You want to know what I want to do? Tack, A, I've seen all your tapes. I've seen you on the Best of Backyard Wrestling Volume 2. How was that? Pretty cool? Did you get any money for that? I wonder if you made a million dollars. I heard they sold like a billion copies. Tack, I know that you're actually a beast. I know that you're actually crazy as shit. And I know that you're a good wrestler. But you don't wrestle like that anymore, Tack. And that's a big problem. Because now you're a technical wrestler. And quite frankly, you fucking suck. You're terrible. You suck so much. You're horrible. Nothing you do means anything. You're not a technical wrestler, Tack. How about this? If I'm so terrible, if I'm so beat ass, why don't we fight right now? I'm ready to go right now. What do you say, tough guy? Want to put your money where your mouth is? You wanna... Here's my money. I got something for you. Instead of fighting right now, why don't me and you have a technical... Technical? You want a technical? How about I technically kick the shit out of you right here? Finish what you had to say. Shut up, you animals. Here's what I have to say. Me and you next week, no face paints, no running around, no joking around. Let's just me and you wrestle. And I guarantee I will beat you. Because I've seen you wrestle, and you cannot wrestle at all. And what you fail to realize is, I can. I can beat you, I can tap you out, I can do almost anything I want to you. Because you're a joke, and you suck. In this ring, next week, next week. Pure, wrestling, pure wrestling, no face paint, no, face paint. no funny things no, on your no. feet, no running around spitting on the crowd, no drooling, no running away like a little girl after I beat the living crap out of you in this ring? For real. Just me and you? For real. Who will decide? Who will win? 
tactical match, right? You want to get in with me? How about it? You want next week? Next week it is. Well, I'd rather have it right now, but I'll take next week then. Real. Well, we're going to have it. Uh, another... Make sure you don't wear those Another little encounter slips, between slip Tack and, you call them right there. and Dr. Oh, Bones and Hooks. I think your grandmother this is, wants some. This is a, a very tense and personal situation. A whole new side of Dr. Bones and, and Tack more than willing to jump up to the challenge here. Next week here on Adrenaline, a pure wrestling match between Tack and Dr. Bones. 